Back in 2008, we launched our deforestation alert system, which is in Portuguese, is SAD. We use satellite imagery to detect deforestation and forest degradation in the Brazilian Amazon. The most important thing about our work is to detect quickly this, this kind of problem and inform the Brazilian society to fight against illegal deforestation. We've spent almost three years working with Carlos Souza and Amazon to build the Earth Engine platform that can support their methodology. We had to build this from scratch. We had to build the infrastructure, and now Google is providing everything. It's providing data, it's providing software. We expect to reduce by 50% the time that we process the data and release the information to the society. This gives much more time every month for documenting what actually happened and supporting law enforcement. Patagominas is a great case study of what we call from the ground to the cloud. Patagominas entrou numa lista em 2007 em que foi incluído como um município que mais desmatava na Amazônia. A prefeitura procurou o Amazon e o Amazon começou a fazer o monitoramento das nossas florestas. We put our deforestation alert system, send the information to the local authorities in Paragominas, train them to use the information and quickly go to the field to verify and correct the drivers of deforestation. Quando o técnico se desloca até a área, ele capta aquela informação, ela serve como um meio legal de você mostrar que estava ocorrendo aquele problema naquela área. Paragominas was the first municipality to be out of the list as a result of this work, quick detection of deforestation and quick action on the ground to respond against illegal deforestation. Nós já reduzimos o nosso desmatamento em 97% em relação a 2010. So it's the collaboration of the satellite imagery and alerting with people on the ground using now Google Android smartphones, running software called Open Data Kit. And you push the button, and it submits it over the phone network, into a database in the Google Cloud, and onto a map. Now that Saj on Earth Engine is running operationally successfully for Brazil, we want to share it with the other countries of the Amazon Basin. Nosotros, como RISC, somos un conjunto de unas 10 instituciones de Surinam, eh, Guyana, Brasil, Colombia, Ecuador, Perú, Bolivia, que estamos interesados en, un, en diferentes objetivos que buscan eh, tener un panorama de cuáles son las principales presiones y amenazas de la Amazonía como un todo. El tener acceso a Google Earth Engine permitiría disminuir sustancialmente los tiempos de cálculo y de procesamiento de datos y nos permitiría poder dedicar más tiempo al análisis de los resultados. We expect other NGOs in tropical forest countries to use this kind of system to monitor their own forests. I think the benefit at this level is unprecedented. We're hoping that this near real-time change detection system can really revolutionize how forests are monitored and also managed in Indonesia. People in Borneo Island, yeah, we can help them with a standardized methodology and they can publish it in, on internet. Amazon and Google Earth Engine are really working on the technology side to make it possible for communities to really contribute to a landscape scale, regional, national scale type of monitoring effort. Creating this collaborative monitoring community powered by the internet. It's never been possible before, and now it is. <laughs>